I would like to address the extremely long-winded narration in the last video and apologize for barely taking a breath. This video, you'll notice, doesn't have that much narration. Basically, I said everything I could in the last video, so this one focuses mostly on our trip from Two Harbors back to Marina del Rey, a total distance of about 30 miles, and it took us roughly seven and a half to eight hours, maybe a little bit more. The wind was not as heavy as it was on the way in to Avalon. We didn't get as much white capping and chopping around, but the waves seemed to be quite a bit bigger. The swell was a little taller, it seemed. But again, without the white caps and the cresting of the tops of the waves, it didn't look as bad, it didn't feel as bad. I think we are. We sailed in the morning till about midday, and then at midday the wind died down completely right around the peninsula over there in San Pedro. And Palos Verdes. And at that point, we dropped sail and motored the rest of the way. Um, and from that peninsula, it's about 11 or 12 miles to Marina del Rey. So it was a little less than halfway that we were able, we ended up having to motor, but um, that still worked out okay. Total and all, I probably used three and a half to four gallons of fuel um, on the trip home with my 15 horsepower Johnson. That's 1970. 172 engine. Um, so that wasn't bad. Well, at least the wind's not crazy today. Huh? At least the wind is not crazy today. Uh, no 14 knots here.
bunch of Michael's boat when it goes over. Yeah, he probably loses us in the trough completely. No, because you can still see him, I die. Oh, I'm sure he doesn't. In those couple of waves back there, he probably could have looked over and seen nothing but our mast. Although he is sitting higher. Because I don't think there's any wind out here now. <laughs> there's nothing. This is dead. 